Hello, everybody. <clears throat> we are here once again, playing everybody's favorite game. Uh, an anonymous gifter, thank you for gifting a sub to Dan Keeter. Uh, this is mission 32C. Super Robot Wars 63 was my favorite Super Robot Wars. Uh, Digital Animal, thank you for the 63 month resub. I appreciate it. Um. <clears throat> Alright. So, there is a split here. I don't know if anybody here knows. We need to get to mission 33C. Thirty one C. Are we on thirty one C? Oh, we are right. Yes, we're on thirty one C. <clears throat> I, I, I thought I, I opened thirty one yesterday to see how long it was. Alright, 31C. The heck is this translator doing? There we go. <laughs> hey, where are we going now? We're going to a base in Caraba, don't you know? Captain Bright mentioned it in this ship's meeting. You must have dozed off and not been listening. You're slacking. Ah, right, so what are we doing here then? You really were asleep, weren't you? Yeah, that's right. Oh, I remember now. Well, this guy, this guy. You have Banjo san in Karaba, right? Our paths crossed at Young Sandomari, but maybe we'll get a chance to see Die turn 3 this time. Hello, spicy yellowtail roll. How's it going? Ah, uh, thank you for the dun dun dun. Anyway, I think Takeru will feel better if he gets down on the ground and rests. Well, I hope so. I'm not sure what to do, but I think it's a good idea. Especially since he often seems to be in a daze since he heard about the mysterious aliens. Is that guy much of a worry wart? I'll check on him again later, and if necessary, tell him to get some rest at the Karaba base. Can you hear me, Marchwind? This is Manjo on Karaba. Manjo, this is Marchwind. It's been a while. Hello, Alan. I'll greet you later, but I'm ready to resupply, so follow my lead and land. Yes, sir. Welcome to the basic Karaba. I'm glad to see you're all doing well. I hear you've been through a lot. Well, yes, after all, Brigadier General Brex is... Yes, it's a shame we lost him, but we can't look back, for the Brigadier's sake, that is. Oh, it's a lot more lively than that, isn't it? There are a lot of people I've never met before. Hi guys, I'm Manjo Farashi from Kalabar. This is my assistant Raika, Beauty, and my butler Garrison. I look forward to working with them. Ah, oh, it's still the same guy. Nice to meet you! Nice to meet you! Hi, nice to meet you. Yo, what up? Nice to meet you. Dun dun dun! I'm Garrison Tokita! Thank you for your time! 
Kinda remind me of Mr. Kerrigan. Oh, I hope you're well. By the way, this is your first time at the base, right? I'll show you around. We can discuss details over dinner after, okay? The battle with the aliens is only intensifying. What do you mean the situation's not getting better? Of course it's because they're tough. The Galactic Empire is increasing its strategies one after another. I'm not sure what to make of it. In fact, we moved too many MDs to the surface unnecessarily during Operation Nova. Now you're repeating yourself. Starov, is the battleship Labeler still not ready for fielding? Yes, we've moved our plans considerably, but it's going to take a while. Send in more colony workers. Complete it as soon as possible. If only we had that thing's main gun. Ah, but no more than now. We need more manpower for the MD planet on the moon. What is this tyranny for? Don't you realize Earth's in danger? Ha ha ha. Tell Mail, what are you doing? The rebellion of the Trey's faction in Marchland still hasn't been resolved. I'm sure you didn't choose that little girl to represent your foundation just so you can get drunk. I leave the ground to you. I'm not going to let you get away with it. Please, take care of it. So, oh, it's true. Oz is fighting a new alien invasion in space, not a rebel army? Yes, I'm sure. I heard they call themselves the Advanced Fleet of the Galactic Imperial Army. The Galactic Imperial Army? That's what they're calling themselves? The Karu? Hey, what's going on, the Karu? So, what is the name of their emperor? Ah, oh, I'm sorry, I'm afraid I don't know that much. I can't tell you much about it. I'm sorry, Takeru. Even Garrison's information network can't go that far. After all, only a handful of people on Earth even knew about the Galactic Empire. Yeah, I guess you're right. Sorry, Mr. Garrison. Oh, no, I'll let you know as soon as I know, so please, just wait. Takeru, are you okay? You should take a rest. No, I'm fine. It's nothing. So... I'm not sure what to make of it, but I think it's a good idea. You can't do it, that's for sure, but don't get weak. You'll lose before you can even fight. Uh... I don't know what this is. You're right! If we fail here, all the fighting we've done will be done for nothing. We're not the same as we used to be. Yes, you have to cheer up for the sake of Lelina and many others. Zul, I know the name of the Emperor of the Galactic Empire. Emperor Zul, why? Hey! Oh. Hey, G, I have something for you. Can you come to the maintenance hangar? Uh, okay. You are Dr. Elizabeth. Why are you here? Hey, G, you look well. Dr. Elizabeth brought me some new raisiners! New raisin? It's your new SPD! From now on, switch to the new raisiner! I can't believe a pacifist like you would carry a weapon like the SPT. To tell you the truth, AG, I'm tired too. I was all for complete pacifism in the Sun Kingdom, but I didn't expect the country to fall. Dot dot dot. Elizabeth, thank you! Please get some rest, I'll have someone show you around. Come on, AG, we're gonna transplant Ray into the new Raisner. You'll help, right? Yes. Who is it? The Karu? What's wrong? Someone's here. Where'd you get in? Who are you? What is it? Hmm. If you can't stop it, try to stop it, Mars. I'm not Mars. What are you talking about? What are you doing? Come after me, traitor. By the order of Emperor of the Zulus, I will kill you. Wait! Don't leave! What is it? I'm going after him anyway. Hey, Takeru, what's wrong with you? 
Mission 30. Dark clouds over Earth's sphere. There's a very inappropriate word in the translation that I'm hoping was a typo. Or a mistranslation. Uh, where are you? Where'd you go? Welcome aboard, Mars. Listen carefully. I've come to deliver the words of your father, Emperor Zul, who's very angry at your treasonous act. Shut up. Are you sure you don't want to obey? Of course not. Who? Killing you will achieve our goal. Die, Mars. Whoa, what the? That's it. What? What? Oh no, it's Geyer! What is it? Mars, don't be afraid. Geyer's here to protect you. What the heck's this guy doing? All on his own? What is this place? Who do you think I am? Geyer? This is what Zul was talking about? Ah, if you're gonna be free of my orders, take him down. Oh, well, I'll just try to bury him too. What's he doing? Uh... What? That robot! Can you hear me? Reveal yourself or we'll attack! Hey, what was that? I don't know. I've lost this part of the translation. I've never seen a robot like that before. with that guy. Oh, I see. When he gets in danger, the five god robot will appear. And when they combine, they're called Mars. Ha ha ha. Hey, what the heck was that? What was what? I've never seen that robot before. What? That robot there, can you hear me? Reveal yourself or we're going to attack. Wait, Captain Bright! That voice, it's Takeru! Takeru? Why are you on that robot? Captain, I don't understand either. What's going on? you have got an Oz unit. Looks like a patrol. What about Takeru? Captain, what are we going to do about Takeru? If that's the care of Miyojin, then let him go. I'll ask what happened later. Understood.
March 1, the Galactic Empire's forces are attacking and Earth's about to be plunged into crisis once again. But instead of obeying Oz, you're trying to ruin the planet. If that's the case, then stop trying to fight us. I've never... I've never declined a challenge to a fight. Then disarm them right here and post them to us. I can't hear you. Of course not. We have no choice but to fight. The only question is whether you'll follow us or not. Who the heck is this guy? Oh, that's uh, Manju. He was in Super Robot Spirits. Was AG like different now? They talked about him being in a new mech. As long as I've still got uh, Amuro. Alright, he can go twice! Oh my god, it's so broken. all my crappy people. And am I getting those Gundam guys back? Waiting on the hot tub stream? What? Apparently Harley and Mojo got in a real big fight today. Uh... Lane, can you hear me? It's... This is the last one. Our last time I'm asking. What do you want to say? I've told you so many times I'm in love with you, and I mean it. I've lived my life pretty much the way I wanna, and it's got me into some strange situations. So what? Well, I was your enemy. You can't blame them for any outcome. But just keep in mind, I was the guy you were in love with. Fine, I'll remember. Ah, oh, I'm relieved to hear that. I thought she hated him. This is mission, uh, 31C. <clears throat> oh, it didn't kill.
Now let's see what this guy's got. Man. He's pretty strong. He said AG's in a new Mac, but this looks like the same one. I don't know, but it's unfortunate we have the Selene mode, because Amuro is clearly the best now. Oh, he has a new weapon. Maybe I'll investigate. Hopefully Selene can move twice at some point. NASCAR 94? I mean 99? I don't want to play it again. Big mistake. Go for it. Let's see what you got. <clears throat> Hello, Laurel's fan. All right, not bad.
voice actors. That would be quick. Play, 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 play. Oh, he's got a map attack now. That's what it is. Okay. Interesting. I guess that's similar to, uh... Um... <clears throat> Quattro's attack. The sauce powder. Feels good to be here again. Get him, Amoro. Dude, the double attack is crazy that he can do that. That's nuts, man. When's he gonna get a triple attack? Oh yeah, the puppy's gotten a big fight today. I didn't know. I guess it happened outside, but somebody was bleeding. I don't think my mom knows who. There was blood on Harley, so maybe it was her. Muro's energy, I've got it maxed out. It can't get any higher. Unless he gains some by leveling up. It's Harley's fault. It's so dumb. I don't know what to do about it. Ojo was chewing on this brush thing. You know, he's like, oh, I want to chew on this. This is what I desire. And Harley's like, oh my god, he has a thing. Oh, I must have that thing. And then Mojo's like, hey, this is my thing. And then a fight broke out. Can't hit the healer? Come on! Probably should have defended. Ooh. Yeah, I should have defended. That's not good. Oh, it's bad. Oh my god. Oh wait, these are friendly troops. <clears throat> Looks like you made it in time. Why are you here? Please, don't misunderstand. It's not that I've been fighting solely out of personal grudge, but now that Oz has been divided into two factions, the Lom fella and the Trays, I know what path to take.
Don Butler V, I can't believe it. I had no idea it was still intact. It's only natural. Hey, Ayuma. Sorry, everyone of Marchland. I'm Chizura Nambara. Please, take care of me from now on. Sorry, Marchland members. I'm Minamibara Chizuru. Please take care of him. I'm Naniwa Juzo. Please take care of me. I'm Kita... I'm Kita Kosuke. I can handle all your mechanical needs. I'm Daisoku Nishikawa. Please take care of... Oh god, this dude has this voice. I'm Daisoku Nishikawa. <laughs> Please take care of me. I can't do a nerdy voice. Come on, come on. Self-introductions are over. I'm sure you'll be pleased to know I'm not the only one. Oh, shoot. What's going on? Oh my god. You're OP now. I don't think we really need you all though. <laughs> We're kinda dominating out here. Alright, looks like we can get Rich to join us. Where did they spawn? God, they're way up here. The bug ships. Can I win in it? Yes. Not this healer, too. Get out of here. I need to have at least one healer. Alright, we gotta get Selene next to Rich. I mean, while the music is repetitive, it's good. Like, I don't mind it at all. <laughs> you know, Mahjong was repetitive, but that music slapped. out of stuff. Beep, beep, beep. Beep, beep, beep. Try this. <clears throat> the Chinka was repetitive and really annoying.
I mean, it was kind of exciting when you actually got the jackpot, I guess. Oh no, this music keeps going. The music's changing because I'm picking a different character. Like, if I just sit here, it's gonna play the full song. You never hear this part of the song, because usually I've swapped the characters by now. I think it just now resets, so it's that long of a loop. Sorry. Hey, can you hear me? Yes, I hear you. Cut the crap. I'm only saying this once. If you're up for it, join Marchwin. Oh, so you are in love with me. No! Hey, don't deny it. I've been thinking that you're at least different from them, so I'm telling you, we need a force to keep fighting. I'm so glad to hear that from you, but I'm still an officer of Oz. If I can survive again, I will. What do you mean? Sorry, I got my own thing going on. I'm not falling apart that easily. Well, then I'll just destroy you. So, like... I think... Do I have to kill him now, or...? Dude, Amuro's gonna be, like, so high level. He's getting all the XP. Nobody else is leveling up. Here, you move away just in case. I don't know what he's about to do. Oh my god. Persuade him again, so... Wait, what does this do? Ooh, Papago added a study feature. Maybe I can, uh... Use that to learn Japanese. Damage tripled? What the heck? He's even more OP. This dude's nuts. Get wrecked. 
I guess I'm gonna leave Rich alone. The mission doesn't end, I'll kill him. I just don't wanna miss out on getting him. He's got enough to kill those two dudes. <laughs> oh wait, he actually doesn't. Uh oh. Oh no! <laughs> It's a pretty cool game, it's just absurdly long. Uh, he should regain 5 energy here, so I'll just dodge this. And that should give me enough to kill this guy. Exactly enough. <laughs> and triple damage. He's gonna, like, even if one of those crazy bosses pop up, he's just gonna, like, <laughs> annihilate them. Alright, well, I guess we have to kill him. Oh, this ended up not being a long mission. We could have done this yesterday. Uh, see you soon, Celine. You're so silly. I don't know what kind of relationship they got going on, but it's weird. It seems we defeated them, but we still need to make sure. Call Takeru Miyojin and the Cosmo Crusher squad to the bridge. Takeru, can you explain the situation? I don't know. Takeru, who are you? Why were you on that thing? I'm Takeru Miyojin. I don't know what it is either. I don't trust him. Is he some kind of alien spy? Akira, you can't be serious. I feel sorry for him. Or was I? Oh. What's the matter, guys? We're friends. I don't know. My friends aren't on those weird robots. What's wrong with you two? He's the one who's gone crazy, Micah. Stop it. Captain, I'm... You don't even know yourself, do you, Takeru? Do you think it's possible you're an alien? I don't know, sir. It's just since the other day there's been a strange voice. Talking directly into my head. It says its name is Mars, but... Captain, no matter where I'm from, my heart is already on Earth. Alright, everyone. Takeru's one of us. That's all. Dot dot dot. Dot dot dot. Captain Bright, would you mind leaving Takeru in our care for a while? Captain? Takeru will, until we get the facts straight, you're gonna stay quiet. I don't want to cause trouble for everyone at March, Flynn. Hmm, that's fine. I'll leave the matter to you all. Thank you, Captain Bright. Let's go, Takeru. It's been a long time since I've seen you. Anjo, what were they doing there? That's a crazy transformation. I wonder how it works. They're the Khan Butler team. Dr. Yotsuya received the machine that Dr. Nambara once developed. Let me introduce myself. I'm 
Aoi... Aoi Yoma. I ride a battle jet. My motorcycle skills are second to none. Oh, you're just being tough. Even me and Kabuto can't keep up with your speed. I'm sure I was a motocross champion on Earth, too. Um, don't talk about me. What? Yo, that's a fairy. <laughs> no, please call me... Me Ferrari. <laughs> Ah, cute. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm Chizuru Nambara. I pilot the Battle Marine. I've studied medicine for a while, so I hope I can be of some help to you. And I'm Daisuku Nishikawa. I run the Battle Tank. My dream is to become a manga artist, but I'm not good at anything but cockroaches. I'm Kosuke Kita of Battle Cram. And last but not least, there's me. I'm Naniwa Juzo. I'm on the Battle Crusher. He's a shooting genius. He won a shooting competition when he was only eight years old. Five battle machines they rival combined to form the 57 meter tall, 550 ton Con Butler V. That's reassuring, keep it up. I look forward to working with you in the future. Mr. Monjo, I'm in the middle of a conversation, but there's a transmission coming in. Direct line? No. Direct line to the Caraba base. It's from Trays. He wished to speak with you in Marchwind. Trays? What? He's here? Oh, I need to, uh. was I? Long time no see, gentlemen. It's good to see you all are doing well. Welcome. I wanted to talk to you in person. I'll let them know your phone number from now on. What can I do for you? You should have guessed, gentlemen. I need your help. I knew it. So you're trying to make up for the conversation we had? No, no, no. At the time, Oz needed to resist the Megs Lovatos Empire. That's why I wanted you in Oz, but the Oz of today is not the Oz of then. They're fighting the Galactic Empire in space, isn't it the same? At first glance, yes. But their power does not lead humanity to a permanent future. In the past, when Oz started down the wrong path, I retreated myself. I left them on the wrong path. That was irresponsible of you. It was a huge inconvenience. The battle will never end unless we use up all our foolish power. Only then can the true future of humanity begin. And it looks like that's what you guys are doing. That is, if the Galactic Empire doesn't show up. The Galactic Empire is indeed something you didn't anticipate, no wonder. That's right, gentlemen. I've tried to be a bystander to history, but I'm abandoning that now. Soon I will unite my rulers who are in rebellion all over the world to confront the Romfella and Galactic Empire. And when I do, I need your help. And we're supposed to trust you? You don't have to answer now. That's all I'll say. Now, if you'll excuse me. You just said what you wanted to say and hung up. What do you mean? Well, I guess we'll see what happens. To be honest, I don't fully trust him. I don't really know. We, can, we can't just deal with Oz in the future. There's only one thing I'm... Oh. Uh... I think we're here. Okay. Yes, after all, we're both from Earth, and now that the Galactic Empire's been up, there's no reason to not fight them. But I don't see it that way. Yeah, they're not going to leave us alone, no matter what, unless we fight. And if we do, they'll probably disarm us, maybe even throw us in jail. You're going to go along with that Trey's guy? I don't know him well, but he looks better than Del Meal and Bass. But you know... 
I don't know about that. Galactic Empire, Emperor Zulu, Mars. Not sure what to make of it. Oh wait, that was this line. It's so confusing the way the translation is. Are you there, Takeru? Mika, what do you want? It's not so much as an errand, you know, Takeru. Don't worry about what happened to everyone today. The truth is, they believe you're one of them, so they were just upset. Inka. That's it. See you later. Friends, huh? Yes. Even if I'm not from Earth, I won't let this Earth be sacrificed. Uh... Emperor, we have regular reports from all fronts. As of 1100 Universal Time, the Yellow Front is 85% under control, and complete victory seems imminent. The Violet Front is at 55% control and advancing. The Orange Front has just achieved complete victory. Thank you for your hard work. Uh... Wait, whoa. There's no report from the Silver Front? Ah, according to the report of the Advanced Fleet and Commander Gandalf, they've already started to engage the Earth forces. Well, let's see what you can do. The Zulus. They sent out an army to overrun Earth after the Mars became uncontrollable. Who's there? Bird, bird, where? Bird, come here. It's you. I heard that you have a spy, but he's too weak-minded to talk to. Hey, you, get out of here. Mars, I want to see you. I don't know what fate awaits me, little brother. I have something I must tell you. Is the Liaison ship and the warp catapult working? Ah. I'm sorry, Mars, but I've drained the energy. Didn't realize you were pretending to be weak-minded. Captain Gorman at the SS. Ah. Give it up. You're guilty of treason against Emperor Zul. Anyone who defies this w eagle will be put to death. There's only one way for you to su survive. Kill Mars! Kill Mars? <laughs> Whew. Alright, so... show any smilers there exist any smilers there exist any smilers there any smilers there exist this is show we found him there. Okay, now we're on 32C. Alright, so in this one we have a choice and we need to not do the wrong thing if we want to keep the translation. Um, I'm gonna take a quick break. Uh, I will be right back. I watch Netflix. 
Uh, used to. I don't really much anymore. Speaking of, Better Call Saul comes on tonight, but I can't watch it till tomorrow, so nobody spoil it or I'm gonna not be happy up with you. No, it's not on a random timer. The only time it's random is when the level loads or you first come out of a door slash pipe. And only the first time. It's on a regular oh, yeah. interval after that. Got past it finally. It's all good, man. I am gonna make a channel in my Discord for show spoilers though. Well, specifically better call Saul spoilers. I, I like to talk about it. I love that show. Alright, come on. Oh my god. Yes, okay. Let's do it. Yes! Yes! Got it. Oh my gosh, that level's so hard. Alright, 30 lives for 4 levels. that I want to get hit, I'm just saying. a good level. Then when I moved to uh, university, Uh, for some reason, the school blocked the MIRC connection. So I had to get this thing called Mibit, which was like a browser-based IRC client. And it was awful. that shell part man the rest was worked really well but that part was rough Kevin oh god I got one Oh! 
Oh, no way! I don't know what the heck happened, but I won. <laughs> I saw Luigi, like, inside of the flag or something. Let's continue. Well, everyone, the situation is as I've described. From now on, we'll be actively engaged in battle once again, with our greatest enemy being the Galactic Empire's advance fleet. <clears throat> Don't follow trees. Uh, Wyvern Drac, thank you for the four month resale with Prime Gaming. Whoa, 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 that last bit was a bit unnecessary. It's fine that you respect our free will, but being overly cautious... Something. I see, I'm sorry, you're right. <laughs> uh, little Wyvern, thank you for the Prime Gaming sub. I appreciate it. Yes, perfect peace is ideal, but now's not the time to discuss such things. In order to have time to discuss it, we must first fight. At least those of us with the power to fight. Ozu, have you lost your stomach too? Of course, I think I know what I have to do. Oops, my bad. You seem to be prepared. I'm relieved. Now then, how do you want to fight this? There are three possible paths we can take. One is to surrender to Oz and join their command. Objection! You gotta be kidding me! I take back what I said. If you do that, everyone here will leave. Uh, of course, nobody's saying that. There's no way Oz will take us seriously, even though we're the largest force in the world. This is out of the question. That's what I'm talking about, you understand? So that leaves us with two choices. Team up with trays or fight on our own. 
This one's difficult. Anyway, it depends how much you trust trees. I don't trust him. I don't trust anyone who tries to reason with me about fighting. No, I don't think so. In fact, the Trey's faction is revolted against the Lomfellow faction. I don't know, I, I can't judge from that. But this time you want to join forces as equals, right? I think we can consider it. What he did in the past under the Muse rule hasn't disappeared. Emil, if you start talking like that... Yeah, we may have had no choice at that time. What's in the past is in the past. I don't know if I should say this, but I think you're right. Huh, looks like we won't be coming to any conclusions anytime soon. No wonder, so many decisions. But that doesn't mean we can't let the clock run out on this one. That's true. What do you think? Why don't we just go out and then decide? Go out? Where? Where? Naturally, the enemy we're fighting in space. This Manjo guy thinks of crazy things with that kind of enthusiasm, taking over the Oz spaceport and going straight into space. That's true, but it seems like there's no other way. I don't mind this kind of thing. That's really bold. It's really daring. It's so cool. Oh, are you into that type of guy? Hey, I'm not saying that, but it's definitely nice. Oh, really? Hey, don't do that. You've already got two beautiful assistants. Who was the one who froze when she was greeted by that beautiful woman? Hey, what are those guys doing? Well, why don't you just leave them alone? <laughs> Is the Lake Victoria base still the most convenient? After all, it's the shortest distance from here. The launch facilities are perfect, and best of all, I fought there once before, so I know the place better than I did the first time. Garrison's already analyzed the data obtained at that time. In fact, it was because of this that I came up with this plan. You're clever as ever. By the way, is it true that some of the Galactic Empire's forces have passed through all these interceptors and landed? I don't know much about it. I just know that I intercepted a transmission from Lake Victoria Base and it said something. <laughs> the situation's changing all the time. We have to hurry. Space. I've always wanted to go to space, but I never thought I'd do it like this. I'm sure you'll be happy to hear that. I wonder if it's safe to leave Yatsuya's old man on Earth. He's going to contact the other doctors and start some important research. It can't be helped. Well, it should be fine. We have to be strong so the doctor won't worry about us. I'm talking about you, Hyoma. What did you say? Oh, nothing. <clears throat> it took me longer to get down to the ground than I thought. Wait for me, traitorous Mars. If I kill you, the Earth will be finished. All for the sake of the great Emperor Zul. Daisuke, look! I wonder if that army... what that army is. It's not Oz. Oh, that's... no way. Daisuke, what's wrong? Finally come. Daisuke, what's wrong with you? Ikari, please listen to me. It seems I can't help but fight. What? What do you mean? I heard about the Grindizer when it was invaded by Meg's Lovato's Empire, but even then you didn't fight. Sure, I don't want to get on it. I was hoping we wouldn't have to fight, but not this time. Today, the Galactic Empire finally arrived. They're not like the Meg's Lovatos. They don't dominate, they only destroy. The Galactic Empire? They destroyed my homeworld, the planet Freed. I'll protect this Earth, my second homeworld, even if it costs my life. Nice, okay. Sorry, Karu. I'm not going. I'm going to my father-in-law's place. I may not be able to come back. I'm going too. You'll need Grindizer's support mecha. Nah, oh, this is dangerous. You can't stop me. There are people who've been fighting on Earth all this time. It's not too late. I'll fight too. Uh, I understand. Don't overdo it.
That's the Lake Victoria base. Everyone, are you ready? Captain Bright, enemy interceptors have been launched. As expected, they've noticed. All planes depart. Don't damage the spaceship. <laughs> 31, return to the battlefield. In order for us to use this launch facility to go into space, we need to eliminate the possibility of interference. Annihilate the enemy. My man. And my girl. Finger guns. <laughs> Sounds like someone cleaning their glasses. Dude, he's overpowered as heck. He's so strong. Yeah, the music's good. I wanna get those G Gundam guys back. They have the good song. Some attacks can only be used if you don't move, and then all attacks have an attack range on them. So you have to be in range, and then if you are in range, it I believe uh, these ones with E beside them, maybe you can't use. I don't know. It's a little confusing.
Yeah, animations definitely add time. Uh, welcome, Night Swing. Saw this coming. Oh my god. Hey, is this the G Gunman people? Oh no, it's not. Is that Dan Kuga in a new Gundam? Hey, I guess Marchman's no good without us. Captain, we'll cover you. Ah, oh, please, Domon, it's you. What happened to the Shining Gundam? That guy fought well. This God Gundam is my new power. God Gundam is the successor to the Shining Gundam. Rain, you're riding a Gundam too? Yes, this is a Rising Gundam. I can fight too. Yeah, let's go, guys. We got Domon back. This guy, who I think kind of sucks, but... Uh, Pat Kilo, thank you for gifting a sub to Rob Zen. <laughs> I appreciate it. is a more and he is cracked <laughs> uh, glad you enjoy it All those dudes all suck. I have Domon back now, so that's one good ship. To be honest, I bet uh, Amoro could just... Well, he would run out of energy, but... Time walk? What do you mean? Just got it. I don't know how or why or what or who or when or when or why or how or where or why blah 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 blah. He recharges energy, but ammo recharges in one turn. Energy takes a while. It's a slow thing. Oh shoot, you can't attack the noob squad? Get out of here. Get him, Selene.
Ow. <clears throat> the mill? Oh well. He's been kicked off the team. How close to beating it? Not close. Past halfway. Beep beep beep. Beep beep beep. Beep beep beep. Beep beep beep. I forgot to move Domon and all those dudes. This is by far the la the longest game. Bet, did anybody see Bar beat a hot dog today? Obliterated the hot dog. Kiwi on a taco. Probably not. <laughs> Which nation will I play as? Whoever's good, like Brazil or something. Domon has a new mech.
just try to attack. <laughs> oh, yeah. Happy 19th of love. Uh, Jelm, thank you for the 19 month resub at 16 in a row. <clears throat> I appreciate it. Oh, 95%. All <clears throat> oh, the music's good. Probably didn't get released due to licensing. See dome on attack. The song's back! Wow! 
What the heck? Dun 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 Oh, come on. Dun 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 Come on. What is your attacks are all trash? Maybe we don't want you back. What is this? Never mind, he's pretty strong. An unidentified force is approaching. It's the Galactic Empire. Oh my god. Who saw this coming? We will kill the Mars. Destroy the Earth. Janela will see to it. What the heck are they? The aliens? There's an aircraft approaching. What the heck? That it? These two units, respond. This is Bright Noah of Marchwind. If you don't respond, we will kill you. I hear you, Marchwind. We are not hostile to you. Please, do not attack. What do you mean? What's going on? We're here to destroy the Galactic Empire's military units, that's all. Uh, that's not the Grendizer. And then Duke Freed came to Earth? Hey, call your brother. This one's on me! You've come to the right place. I won't let this Earth become like the planet Freed. <laughs> Jesus, AG, how far can you go? That's far. Hey, yo, who need healing? Most of this cart is just text. You would have a map to say, hey, load the following units in. You'd have one place all these ships are stored, and then based on what mission you're on, it would say... You'd use like a hash map or something to... It'd be very easy to do these missions. Like, you'd have to store the graphic for this ship, but that's not that hard. Ooh, I haven't used this yet. The heck? Oh god, do I move there? Oh no. AG's not that good at dodging. <laughs> so, <laughs> this 
could be trouble. These ships all seem weak, though, so maybe it's not bad. Beep, beep, beep. Beep, beep, beep. gonna head in. 23%, that's pretty good. <clears throat> Bonk. What are you thinking, buddy? Out of everybody, you choose him? <laughs> they look like what? You know, this guy's smart. This is actually a decent matchup. I need to level him up. What are you, stupid? Little tiny ships are like so bad. <laughs> oh, there we go. Look at this. <laughs> That's a pretty cool attack. Mon's going Super Saiyan.
Guess we'll get these guys, whatever they are. Uh oh. Oh wait, no, these ships suck. This is one of the bad ones. Oh god, I used all his energy doing that though. Da 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 da. Named him Cyclops. The Quattro. Jesus, show, calm down. Thirteen thousand two hundred. Jesus. Ten K, no problem. Oh, that's a cool mech. I bet it's dead. Mm -hmm. 
Moro can't attack in the water, I think. One downfall of him. That's also a cool mech. Triple damage. You had a good run, dude, but this is the end for you. Yeah, it is supposed to be shallow water. I don't know what that is. Hey, it's these guys. Aw, oh, dear. Looks like it's over already. Aw, oh, jeez, I was just about to give him a powered-up machine gun punch. You guys are here, too? Uh-huh. Nice to meet you, ladies and gentlemen of Marchwind. Dude, the, the gang's getting back together. Alright, now's the time. Hurry up and get ready to launch. We don't have much time. Thanks for your help. You're... Who, who's that robot? My name is Daisuke Umo, and her name is Hikaru Ron. We're... Daisuke, so you're Daisuke after all. Oji-kun, you know this person? Yes, I've met him before. I was accompanied by my grandfather to the Institute of Space and Astronautical Science, and he introduced me as Dr. Uman's son. Oji-kun? Huh? Why are you talking about? Well, a lot of things have happened, but it seems I was right after all. Daisuke, I knew you were something else. I'm just another Earthling who loves this planet. Why on Earth are you talking about when you say, as an Earthling? You can explain it to me, right? I don't know. I'm a prince of the planet Freed, and my home planet Freed was destroyed by the Galactic Empire. Duke Freed. At first, I didn't plan to fight either, which is why I didn't when the Megzabatos Empire invaded Earth. But then they came, the Galactic Empire. They're the ones who destroyed the planet Freed. Unlike the Muge Empire, they don't rule, they only destroy. This time I will protect my second home with everything I've got. Daisuke. Even if he's not from Earth, I understand his motives, and that robot is powerful. That's Grandizer, the guardian god of the planet Freed. Daisuke, you said earlier you thought you were from Earth. Huh? If you're from Earth, you should fight with us like an Earthling. You're the one who was planning on going in alone anyway, aren't you? You're too cool for your own good. Da da da. I understand what you're saying. If you're willing to fight with us, we'd welcome you, Duke Freed. It seems that's the way to go. I understand. I'll be counting on you. No, that's not Grindeezer. I don't know. It's unforgivable. I'll get it back for you. Domon, Shinobu, and everyone else, thanks for coming. I gave up thinking I'd be able to see you once I got into space. Never thought I'd see you here. Hmm, as expected, I couldn't follow you into space. I got a call from Mr. Garrison and flew here in a hurry. I'm sure you didn't think you'd be able to get by without us, did you? Ah, it's my pleasure. I'm looking forward to it. This enemy is tough. I thought you might need our help. Wow, you've changed somehow, and so everyone else in the shuffle. So much has happened since I left. At any rate, we're able to de we were able to defeat the Devil Gundam. That's also because of Swartz's noble sacrifice. And Swartz's... will never appear in front of us again. So... Well, now we can go into space without any worries. 
We've also loaded up the God Gundam and the Rising Gundam. You mean those new Gundams? I asked Karaba for that machine through Alan-san. What have the Beast War Machine Squad been up to for a while? We joined up with General Igor and Dr. Hazuki. Those two are doing something at the old Beast War Machine base. Since they're those two, I'm sure they didn't do it for nothing. I think it's a good idea. Here's the Grand Deezer. Found it, you devils! Ah, huh, was there a girl like that? Oh, he looks strange. Hey, wait! They found us! Hey! Ah! Koji! Be careful! You may look cute, but you're the enemy. Prepare yourselves, demons! Wait, that's a pendant! Yes? Who, you, who are you? Grace Maria Freed, daughter of King Freed. I'm here to get Grandizer back. King Freed's daughter, Maria. Daisuke, you can't stop me with your arm. Maria, this... The same pendant, no way. Yes, I am Duke Freed. Big brother, you're really my brother. Yep. You're alive, aren't you? Maria, you're the one who should be. At that time, I was taken by Chamberlain to escape the planet Freed and came to Earth. Well, Maria, it's good to see you. I'm glad I met you. We'll be together from now on. Big brother! Hey, Koji, what are you crying about? Because Daisuke-san is... What's going on? I can't really say. Go ask someone else. I must say, it's a very naive idea. I think I speak for Lomfella, don't you? I'm sure you'll find something that works for you. Very well. We'll see what your opinion is there. Alina, I specifically took you in to solidify the uni unity of Oz, but you may become a hindrance if you continue like this. Guys, let me introduce you to my sister. Oh, wait. Here we go. Guys, let me introduce you to my sister, Grace Maria Free. If she's Daisuke's sister, she must be a survivor from Free. I hope you'll allow my sister to accompany me, just as you did when you welcomed me and Ikaru-san as your friends. Yes, I'm Grace Maria Free. Let me fight against those demons together with my brother and everyone else, please. Don't worry, Maria. There's no one here who would kick out a person who's willing to fight gonna be tough, but we look forward to working with you. Thank you, Koji. I'll do my best. Oh, by the way, are you okay with your wound from that time? I'm fine, I'm fine. That doesn't count as an injury. Oh my god, you guys suddenly seem to be getting along well. What's going on? Koji, hey! I'm not going in there. You'll be able to figure it out. Koji's a disaster, too. What is it? What's wrong? It's nothing. I'm Masato Shikibu, pilot of the Land Liger. It's nice to meet you, Maria. If there's anything you don't understand, just ask. Hey, where are you taking Koji? What's with the laugh, Lou? Masato, he says you're out of his sight. Hey, it's just bad timing. Ikaru-san, I have two more support mecha for Grandizer. Ikaru-san, there are two more that I need to get, and I was wondering if you could help me. Okay, let's go. I'll go with you. We need another pilot if there's two of them. Thank you, you guys are fine. Come on. Master Katoru. Rashid, and everyone from the Malganok Corps. How'd you find us? Sorry for the delay. It's okay. A man named Banjo from Karaba informed me and I rushed over. But I have something for you, Master. I brought it. For me? What is it? I wanted your Gundam to be able to fight in space, so I brought you parts for space combat. So my Sandrock can go into space too? There were more parts I wanted to bring. 
Oh, that's enough. Thank you so much. What are you and Rashid going to do now? As much as I'd like to join you, we'll be fighting on the ground. I heard the Karaba organization is short on manpower. Don't worry, Master. You can concentrate on your own fight. All right, take care. I'm off. There's a lot of noise. What's going on? The heroine of rumors is here. I'm not a fan of jokes. Everyone thinks it or something. What do you mean? That thing, that thing. That thing? You idiot. I'm happy to see you've come all this way to welcome me, my dear Selene. But why are you here? Why? You told me to come to Marchwind. That's not what I'm talking about. I thought you were supposed to be dead. That's terrible. You think you can just kill me? It's true. I almost died. But since you asked me out, it looks like my luck was about to run out and has now returned. Dot, dot, dot. Well, that's it. I'm looking forward to working with you. Ah, Celine, there you are, just in time. What is it, Captain Quattro? He's been placed on probation for a while, so I've allowed him to accompany us. What? Captain, I'm a pilot. Don't you think you should take responsibility for your words? Yes. That's what I'm talking about, Mr. Rich Criswell. We want good pilots too, so we're counting on you. I'm sure you'll be pleased to know I'm not the only one who's a fan of your work. Ta ta ta! I'm sure you'll agree. You're being too familiar, you know. Shut up! It's scary. It's okay. I'll be with you for the rest of our lives. Da da da! Now's it's time to make a decision. Once we're up in space, there's no turning back. Let's choose our destiny. Join the trays or fight on our own. Well, I don't know what to do. To be honest, I've been thinking about it for a while, but I haven't come to a decision. I'm the same way. The more I think, the more I can. Well then, I guess it can't be helped. That said, I think a majority vote's the way to go. Can we go to... Tomorrow? Do you have any suggestions? Yeah, I'll let Celine decide. Me? Why? This is such an important thing. It just seems that you have some inspiration or something that'll affect your destiny in a big way. Remind me, one day during Operation Daybreak, we were faced with a similar choice. Circumstances have certainly changed from then to now, but I think we made the right decision, and I think it was your decision that was the deciding factor. But... I see, you're right. You may not be aware of it, but you certainly have the power to do so. I want to leave it to you. How about you guys? That's fine with me too. It's a bit of a circle anyway, so just make it a quick decision. Lane, decide with conference. Confidence. I think I want option two. How many subs to eat a hot dog on stream? Uh. You know what? I'm not quite as big of a streamer as Barb, so, uh, 49. <laughs> Forty-nine subs, I'll eat a hot dog. We'll fight on our own. Okay, it's decided. That's it, everyone. So you're sure we're on the right track?
Wait, why are there two shows? Show? You can't... There's not two shows. I don't know if somebody just at some point says 49 subs and then they say eat a hot <laughs> I don't really care. Also don't do it. That's dumb. Uh, I want to take a very quick break. Be right back. God, dude. <laughs> I don't know why they even let them come to the school, I guess. They're like, oh my god, this is gonna put us on the map and we'll get all this funding. I don't know. Oh yeah. That was tough. Uh, cool level, though. Trials of Death Light. Oh, yeah. And Trials of Death without, Extremely without Light. Chicken. Fine, I just... I feel like I should have beaten it. Oh no. Come on. There we go, Utah. Oh man. <laughs> Took forever. Should be on 33C. I really hope so. Probably should have made a second save just in case. But too late now. <laughs> uh, Ragnar, thank you so much for. Five gift subs to Introvert, Fred as Scotty351, Bruss, Sneezeball, Vix, and B. I appreciate it. <laughs> Farewell, Earth. Marchwind on your journey. Well, we really did come to space, didn't we? Oh. I'm not sure what to say. I think this translator, sometimes it doesn't know how to translate it, so it either puts I'm not sure what to say or I'm not sure what to make of it. Because these people say that a lot, and I don't think it's actually saying that. Have you done it? Have you done it yet? Yes, yes, we've done it so many times. We're bored. 
I guess you have to be born and raised on Earth to share this feeling. Where's the boss and Shinobi? They were playing somersaults in the aisle just now. No, how old are those guys? The G's of going up into space are amazing. I've heard about them, but I didn't think it was like that. Aha, the old spaceships weren't like this. Even the trained astronauts were under a lot of strain. The early colony immigrants were literally risking their lives. Is that so? We're so blessed thanks to technology, aren't we? Yep. In the past, human beings endured many hardships and went into space. They believed there was a land of hope in space that they thought it was much more constructive than hating the elites on Earth who drove them into the sky. There was no hope for the universe. There's no hope for the universe? Come on, man. At least the Earth and the colonies are good now. Captain Quattro? I don't understand what you're saying. I've been out of space for a long time, and I don't feel very well. That doesn't sound like you. You're not getting older. Accumulating time's not a bad thing. Let's get some rest. What happened to the aircraft that was not designed for use in space? Yeah, we had that problem. Don't worry about it. We're almost finished fixing it up for space combat specifications. Now my boss ship can be active in space. Finally in space, Amoro. Huh? What's wrong? Nothing. Sorry, I'm going back to my room. What? Hey, Amoro? Amoro, something's wrong. Leave him alone. He wants to be alone, so you should leave him alone. What? It's none of your business. This is between us. Ertachka, you must have the proper qualifications to step into people's minds. I think I'm qualified to do that. I think it's impossible to meet the dead, but somewhere I believe it. That's why I'm afraid of this universe where Lara died. Amora, there are things that the living should do while they're still alive, and doing them is also a way to pay tribute to the dead. Well, we're going to be fighting the Galactic Empire on our own from now on. So first, we need to secure a base in space. You sound like a stranger. I'm sure you have an idea. Yeah, Anjo's received information from General Igor, and we're already on our way there. I see. Ravian Rose. Yep. What the heck is that? It's a Rose dock ship. But wasn't it sunk in the One Year War? No, that was Brigadier Brex's cover. The lobby in Rose is a, in reef space. If we can rendezvous with them, we can resupply, right? Yep, but we don't know where they are at the moment either. I told you we're in reef space. A reef space is fast. If we enter it carelessly, it'll be very dangerous. Oh, so that's how it is. Oh well, anyway, let's see if we can make contact. How'd it go? Oh, I was able to confirm the coordinates of the Ravian Rose. We did it. That means we don't have to worry about supplies. I have another piece of good news. The Liberation Front has an aircraft in Ravian Rose that they've developed before the Oz coup. So we can increase our strength. That's very convenient. All right, for now, we'll hurry to meet up with the Ravian Rose. Nani? Mars, can you hear me, Mars? Who is it? Mars, come out. I need to talk to you. That voice is the man who told me about Geyer and God Mars? What? That's right. I want to tell you something important. Come out, Mars. Shut up. I'm Takeru Miyojin. Takeru, not Mars. You're Mars. Listen to me and you'll understand. Shut up and get lost. Honey? The battleship was confirmed the other day was still the Blalden. Although Oz doesn't seem to have a problem with it, we believe Haman is definitely on board. I see. The Axis is finally on the move. If their arm is as I predicted, this is going to be a lot of trouble. Oh, they're taking advantage of the chaos. That's how they do it. I'll let Bright and the others know. 
up the Haman Khan. You will continue to monitor him. Yes, sir. Now go. Ah, now the ghost of... Remnants of Zeon. I've heard a lot about it. I've heard they're trying to restore the Zeon Empire with their resource satellite, the Axis. But since the invasion of the Muge Empire, there's been no word of them, has there? I thought it had been wiped out. And the general staff of the former occupation forces were fighting. They're building up, waiting for an opportunity. I'm Ankar. It's a woman I know. I was in the Axis for a short time right after the One Year War. I decided that I left her when I decided to fight on Earth, and I haven't seen her since then. I see. Well, let's not ask too many questions. So where they're going to be enemies, or they're just someone we can join up with? I don't know. They don't necessarily have to be enemies. I don't know, but I don't see how they can be on our side forever, that's for sure. I don't know. <clears throat> oh my god, asteroids. Uh... If we make a navigation error in reef space, we might not be able to get out again, so proceed with caution. Yes, just sit back and play in zero gravity. I've heard that visibility in reef space is poor. I never thought it'd be this bad. If we get attacked here, we're in trouble. You say such ominous... Oh, wait. You say such ominous things again. If it really happens, we'll be in trouble. Alarm! Captain Bright, there's many aircraft in front of us. These are the same ones at the spaceport. It's the Galactic Empire. What the heck? Battle stations. Oh my god, I don't care what you say. What do we do? What do we do? It's basic tactics. You guys, what are you on about? Let's go. Alarm? The enemy's attacking. At a time like this? What? Mars, come out. I need to talk to you. The voices are getting closer. No way, you're one of those enemies. Mars! Who? Hey, what's going on? Someone's calling out to someone, trying to wake something up. Who is it? Maria, hey, what's going on? I don't know, but it's not an enemy. You can feel the heart on the person. It's like love for your immediate family. 32. Threat of the Galactic Empire. Waiting on the translation. <clears throat> Mard, don't forget about the bomb attached to your plane. If you act strangely, it'll explode on the spot. If you kill Mars, I'll disarm it. I understand. Dude, I have so many high levels. What if I'm leaving somebody out? Ah, that's not Grandizer. And Duke Freed was coming to Earth? Hey, contact Commander Gondal. Mars and Duke Freed, this one's on me! You're here, and I'm not gonna let this Earth become like Planet Freed. Mars, I want to see you, I want to talk to you. It's you again! Yes, that's right, I want to tell you something important. Come out, Mars. But I'm in a battle now, there's no plane I can leave alone. You can call Gayer, wherever he is, he'll answer when you call him. I understand. What's wrong? Uh, sorry. Wait a minute, you were told not to move without permission. Is 
that the guy called Gayer? The carries on it? There he is. Mars, let's go. What are you doing? You lied when you said you wanted to talk to me. No! You can't defeat the Galactic Empire with that arm. My name is Marg. You can't defeat me like that. Who are you? You're my brother. We're twin brothers. What the heck? I have a brother? Let's go, Mars. Fight. If we're brothers, then why? I can only live while I'm fighting. My father's name is Idea, and my mother's name is Ida. Ah! Dot dot dot! What's with the bomb on that plane? Oh yeah! Come on, fight me, Mars! Guys, please, destroy the captain's plane! Uh, alright, we're in space now. This is pretty augers. I mean, it looks like I have most people, right? I have Sho, my healers, Quattro, AG, Celine, Amoro, even him. Domon's here. He's here, I guess. This guy, I don't know if we oh, yeah, haven't used him yet. These dudes, uh, one of these dudes are actually good. Oh, uh, the one who's actually good isn't out here. He, like, sends out those red things. This guy, I'm pretty sh No, this guy's- This guy sucks. Alright, we don't want him. Actually, I'm gonna reset. I don't want him, he's so bad. It's not gonna take long to get back, because we just mashed through the text. I wish you could view pictures there. I mean, everybody I had is fine, other than that guy, so I'm just gonna make sure not to pick him. <clears throat> He's level 27. This guy. Crap. Much longer. A lot longer.
Hey, we got him now. Welcome, Busy Bake. <sighs> Big mistake, buddy. a crappy attack. The heck, Amora. to do something about the bomb. Mark. 20k, what the heck, man? See what you got. Sixty one per cent. Even worse. Garbage. we won't kill him then.
Uh, Shigio, thank you for gifting a sub to Japanese Tech Speedrun. I appreciate it. An anonymous gifter, thank you for gifting us of you. Thank you, Domo. I appreciate it. Oh, yeah. An anonymous gifter, thank you for gifting us of the SMK Tarma 04. I appreciate it. Do, 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 do. <sighs> Dude, when we're done with this game, though, it's gonna be hype. We've had some long ones recently, like. We had Body Harvest, Command and Conquer, now this. Is it the last boss? This is not the last boss. Thankfully, no sequel. Nah, we'll be fine. It seems like we're getting through this a lot quicker now. Once we got past that one boss fight level. is about to like 1v20. Like we've gotten through nine missions, like three missions per day. If we did that from the beginning, it would have only taken what, like 18, 17 days to beat this. So the pace has picked up, definitely. Joe's getting strong now. 3k damage.
Hello, street rat. Get the red swoosh hairstyle next. Um, no. Big mistake, fella. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Twenty nine down, only twenty three to go. Uh, Grisby, thank you for the 29 month reset of Prime Gaming. I appreciate it. Curious how much damage this will do. <clears throat> Not bad. Forty-eight hours has been achieved. I hope I get those Gundam Wing guys back at some point. <clears throat> 48 hour stream? Never!
Definitely get your money's worth. Uh, there's a lot more hours to this game. I really like this game, but nothing wrong with this game whatsoever. Like, am I gonna complain? Like, man, this game just has too much content. It's so annoying. be done. I ain't quitting. You just have to wait. Rapidly change wigs to match the characters as they attack. No, you. G-Hack, enjoy your taco. I don't think I healed him. Oh no! I forgot. Hope this doesn't make me lose. Oh, maybe he can't die. gets weak, he turns into the God Gundam. Five God Gundam. <laughs> I really want to try this out. Triple damage. Thirty <laughs> K. Oh, my God. <laughs> 
Oh, man. No, the mission failed. Arg, the bomb control's been released. Evacuate, please. I understand. I'll do it. Oh my god, who saw this coming? Captain Black, he's been killed? Ah, you earthlings? Takamari. like all the games. Yeah, we're in space now. It's a fun game. Just long. The story's actually kind of interesting. I might be the only one who's following along, but...
every time I get a new character now, I just kind of use the same voice. There's too many people. Hero's not back. I want to get him back. He's good. <clears throat> uh, they're not left out. It does not end. Somehow the devs fit an infinite amount of missions. I don't know how. Like, it doesn't make sense. But... And it's, they're not like generated, they're just there. Like, the list. If you open the source code and look at the list of missions, it goes infinite. I feel like we'll save it. Jesus! Halfway done. Uh, past halfway. <laughs> yeah, this is the final thing I have to kill. Oh, I didn't notice this dude up here.
Deep. Deep, deep. Deep, deep. Deep, deep. Deep, 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 deep. In a beep, deep, beep, beep. Beep, deep, beep. In a beep, deep, beep, beep. Beep, 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 beep. Triple damage. <clears throat> oh. They don't. I guess this is a little overkill. Ah, uh, are you okay? Is this? We're in the medical room of Marchwin's battleship. Don't worry about it. Oh, we've already investigated Earth. Marchwind is rebelling against the forces currently in control of the planet, right? Yep. Mars, I have something to tell you. Am I really Mars from the same planet as you? Yep, I am. You're not from Earth, and your real name is Mars, my brother. My brother? Then you have my real father and mother, too. My father and mother, they're dead. What? Talk to me. Yeah, I'm gonna pass on to you the memories I inherited from my father and mother. Give me your hand. My hand? You already know that we have special abilities. It's faster than talking to you. Alright. Ah, this is Pilot Gishin, my father and mother. My father researched anti-proton energy, and Geyer is destroyed. Or I die and the anti-proton bomb explodes. Yes, that's right. Zulu sent Geyer to Earth with the idea that this day would come. You're the key to the bomb on Geyer, and you're still a baby. If the anti-proton bomb explodes, the Earth's atmosphere will be blown away. So I was raised on Earth as an abandoned child. My father rebelled against Zul and was executed. My mother kept pleading with Zul to give you back to her. And years ago, my real parents. I didn't know that, brother. Mars, ugh. Brother! It's okay, Mars, my brother. I've always wanted to meet you. I've been waiting for the day to meet you. Brother! Mars, I have something to give to you. Other than Geyer, the other five robots, the five god robots, are your guardians. Sent in secret by your father to Zul. If Geyer is in danger, they will automatically protect him. Do not let the anti-proton bomb explode. Five god robots? This pendant for you. With it, you can freely control the five god robot and become god Mars at any time. Use it to live up to your father's wish for peace in the universe. Well, I didn't know that was possible. Come on, you two should apologize to, to Karu. You should both apologize. He said something terrible about being an alien spy. I'm sorry, Takeru. I was just, you know, worried. I'm sorry, I doubted you. Give me a break. It's okay. This way, the misunderstanding's cleared up. I'm glad to hear that, right, A.G.? Yeah. Thank you, A.G. Anna. From the time I first met you, I knew you weren't from Earth. I didn't think you were from the planet Kishin. Ice K, you know anything about it? Yeah, the planet Gishun is the birthplace of the Galactic Empire. It's also their home base. And you? I am Duke, Prince of the Planet Freed. I am the man whose homeworld was destroyed by them. Of the planet Freed, oh yeah. Mark, you and I both know firsthand the horrors of Emperor Zul. We know what will happen if we let this planet fall into his hands. Mark, we're needed on Earth. Daisuke! Duke, the planet free. Thank you. I'll fight too, to protect my brother's second home. No, to defeat Emperor Zul. Robbie and Rose confirmed. Call, sign transmitting. Alright, prepare to birth. Captain Bright, Captain Bright! Acting Captain Emily? 
Yes, sir. I've been waiting for you for a long time, believing you'd come. What? Captain Bright, have you forgotten? I thought the captain asked me to do something for him, so I try my best. Oh, no, it's... Dot dot dot. Dot dot dot. Dot dot dot. Dot dot dot. What? What? What's wrong with everyone? What are you guys looking at? Let's get to work. Yes, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Come on, guys, let's go. Wow, this is the Gundam GP03? Huh? You recognize it? Of course I do. The docked form with the weapon container over there is the normal operational form. I've heard it's called the Dendrobium. Wow, you really know your stuff. When it comes to MS, leave it to me. This is the Z Gundam? I heard that Camille participated in the development of this machine. Yeah, it's just a basic design, but it's available at... But how did you manage to create something like this? I'm sorry. I don't know what to make of it. It was a lot of work. You are... My name is Chain Agi. I used to be a technical officer for the Federation, and now I'm on the crew of the Ravian Rose. Well, nice to meet you. I'm... I know you, Captain Amora Ray. I've been waiting to meet you for a long time. You must be disappointed seeing the real thing. Not at all. It made me want to do my best even more. What are you talking about? It's my dream. My dream to build a Gundam for Captain Amora to ride. Speaking of which, you mentioned Anaheim. Yes, since the time when we were under the control of the Empire, they've been cooperating with us on the condition we provide them with the actual battle data. To the Liberation Front, on the back of cooperating with the Imperial Army and Romfella, they're really merchants of death, aren't they? It's not pleasant, but I'd like to think that one of the reasons is good for the people of Earth. Hey you, what are you doing? We're Tachka. What? You... Here, Tachka Irma, the crew of the Argama, don't mess with Amoro too much. There's no reason for you to say that. I'm Amoro's girlfriend. Hmm, I see. But I can work with you to build an MS for Captain Amoro. A new Gundam. What about it? It means I can be of service to them. Oh, hey, Amoro, where are you going? Uh, sorry, I gotta go return some videotapes. I'm coming too. I'm the chief mechanic here. Hey, wait! Amoro! I've seen some amazing stuff. Really? Oh wait. Really, really? But Captain Amoro is surprisingly unpredictable, isn't he? Oh, I always found that women only get in the way of a fight. Not that time. Oh, no, I wasn't talking about you. I'm not sure what you're doing. Why are you pointing a gun at me? Who are you? Not so long ago, we were known as the Trays, but now we call ourselves the Colonial Revolutionary Army White Thing. What the heck? Chief Engineer Sarov, the surface of the moon has been conquered by our comrades, and you are to declare defeat. Not so fast. Wait, don't let him get away. I can't lose, as long as I have my MD. Blow up the whole room. IMD is invincible. Ha ha ha. Oh my. Gamatov, what was that? What did you do, you idiot? Ha ha. For saying the moon is under control? Yes, sir. The insurgents acted simultaneously in every department and took over the center of the MD system. By the time we put up a fight, it was already... What about Sarov? Was he captured? No, oh, the chief engineer is killed in an explosion during the battle. Nonsense! Nonsense! The Galactic Empire will go on the offensive at once. I don't care what happens to the Earth. It doesn't matter what happens to Earth. So that's what you've done. You've strangled yourself. You fools. Oi, oh, did you hear about the rebels in Oz taking over the moon? White thing, right? I know. Amatov probably had no idea there'd be another rebellion. The Galactic Empire forces are invading. This is not the time to start a rivalry. 
Ah, oh, that's nuts. What are you thinking when the Earth's fear itself is at stake? At a time like this, why on Earth? Ah. <sighs> yeah, fine, show any smilers. Show any smilers. Show any smilers. Wait, no, not his actual stats. Show any smilers. Why are there two shows? That's so confusing. What is this one? The maxed out power. Yeah, it could be his little old mech, I guess. Back. Can you believe Donald Duck Quack Attack was the game before this one? Seems like so long ago we were playing that. Waiting on the translation. We'll be circling, keeping an eye out for guerrilla soldiers. We'll be arriving at the Space Fortress Bulge a little later than expected. I never thought I'd see a frontline commander at my age. The rebels will go directly to the Bulge and encourage Jemitov and the others. The Slade spaceship? This is... What's going on? Whoa, whoa! Is that a White Fang attack? I can't believe there's such a large force here. Send out the MD units. There's too many of them. Shake it off. Get to the bulge. <laughs> no. Go catch up with us. Oh no. It's me. What do I do? Whoa. Is it true that Lord Del Mayo was attacked when he went to space? Yes, it is. On the way to the bulge fortress shortly after exiting the atmosphere, an urgent transmission was received from stating they were being attacked by a White Fang MD unit. So, what happened after the transmission? It went straight to a halt. It was probably shot down by... your grandfather. Da da da! You were a fine man, grandfather. Dorothy does not cry. Dorothy doesn't cry for her grandfather's last breath as a brave soldier was on the battlefield. Dorothy! Lord Delmoyer is dead. The situation's unfolding faster than I thought. Preparations are progressing as we planned. Yes, it's the beginning of the third act, lady. The characters are all here. We just need to raise the curtain. Ah, will it finally be you? No, I'm not the one opening the curtain. Perhaps one of them who has seen the future with his own eyes. Excuse me, you must be Special Agent Zex Marquis. You've got the wrong person. I am not named as such. So are you Mr. Miliardo Peacecraft, or would you prefer I call you Lightning Count? I'm sorry, there's nothing to say. Please leave. No, I would very much like to hear it. I'm a revolutionary fighter from the colonies. My name is White Thing No Cairn. I'm Special Colonel Zex, and I need you to come with me to space with your Gundam. Gundam, and what are you trying to get me to do? The Gundam is a symbol of rebellion. We need you. A symbol of rebellion? What do you need me for? For the free will of the citizens of the colonies, of course. What if I say no? Didn't you once show understanding for the independence of the colonies as an ambassador? Indeed. I once believed it would be the future of humanity, but not now. Hence... You're saying you're refusing to go? The opposite. 
I'll take you up on it. What? So you're going to come to space? Or perhaps this is how the entire human race will perish at the hands of aliens. But if I am right about the future that Epion has entrusted to me, I will be able to... Um, I see you've brought an interesting role. Thank you. Hey, Takeru's brother visiting again? Yeah, I'm sorry. I don't have much time for breaks. I'm in a hurry. I'm sure you'll be happy to hear how the Shaolin brothers are doing. I just remembered. I've been thinking about it for a while. Oh, I see. That's right. Aniki is... What the heck? Let's go! Uh... Takeru's brother, you okay? What's going on? I don't know, I don't know. There was a sudden explosion. Brother! Hey! Has he been taken away? Brother! Hey, don't do anything rash! God, Mars! Thirty-three white thing. Do 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 do. Ah, where did they go, brother? Ani. Wahaha! <laughs> oh, you are... Welcome, Marg! What have you done with Marg? Perhaps it's because you were sent to Earth as a child that you don't know how to be polite to the Emperor. No need to be polite. Mars, return to my galactic empire. The universe is vast. You still have a lot of work to do. Destroy the Earth and come back. Shut up, Zul. You tried to trick me saying you were my father. I'm not who you think I am. You fool. Ah, what? Oh man, what the heck is that? Oh my god, Mark's been taken. What? Akira's brother went out after it. Akira's guy, did he kidnap Marg? That guy is Zul, the Emperor of the Galactic Empire. What? Takeru alone is dangerous. Everyone, get out! This guy is the crappy one. We are currently playing the game. This is the game that we are playing. The game. Game, 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 game. This might be a boss level. I can beat it today? No. Even if I stream 24 hours straight. No.
Oh, this is a boss, alright. Let's get people in position. I would never do a 24 hour stream, like, there's not, I didn't even do it for charity. Never happening. Didn't Celine get something that it halves the boss's hit rate? That would be really good. million dollars? Well, then I'd do it. not so bad. This is so bad. Uh... Things have suddenly changed. I mean, these dudes all mostly all suck. Does have good music. No, I think we're still good. Better than Charlie Blast's territory? I think so, yeah. Banjo TV. Oh, this might be a challenge.
Pathetic. Shares a lot with Fire Emblem. No, it could be Banjo doesn't get picked till the very end, and then we just play both back to back. Yeah, it's kind of unfortunate we got Stadium so quickly. I do hope the uh, Stadium 2 video pops off like Stadium 1. This Pokemon Stadium 1 was the original. That, like, That's what started the growth of this challenge on YouTube. Seriously? I wanted to do one more mission. I was like, oh, I'll fit it in. <laughs> Why is it unfortunate? Just because, like, this is going to go into, like, 2024, and we've already... You know, like, there's no Pokemon Stadium to look forward to now. Like, yeah, there's Pokemon Snap, which people seem to love that. I don't like it that well. It's kind of boring to me. Yeah, Star Wars is over with quickly as well. Not played Forsaken. <laughs> Quest sixty four, that'll be cool, I think. Dang it, Celine.
The three Star Wars games were all very different. This the longest it very well could be. This is a good candidate. Starcraft, yeah. That's definitely the longest non-Japanese game, but like this one, we didn't know this was going to be so long. <laughs> so, we shall see. Dude, she's strong. I wonder how these people survive when they're out here, like... How can you just eject when you're in space? Maybe through the power of friendship.
Elmo. Dude, I'm excited for the Elmo games. I liked Turok 1. That was pretty fun. Probably Densha de Go was. Uh, that was a surprising one. <clears throat> That's not good. Alright, nobody else can reach. That's good. Fishing game. There are still a lot of hours left. for the host and the raid. Uh, I appreciate it. Thank you. Uh, thanks. How was your stream, dude? Um, we are playing a game called Super Robot Wars 64. It is incredibly long. Uh, but I appreciate it, thank you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> We're like invading a bulge ship or something right now. They were like, get to the bulge! shouldn't have done that. Uh, I feel like this is safe. Just in case, I'll do this. Um, but yeah, welcome. Uh, we're doing a challenge right now to beat every N64 game ever released, and this is one such game. It's incredibly long. This could be the longest there is entire. 
in the entire thing. This is by far the longest so far. It's not even close. It is a pretty good game. I've enjoyed it. It's not been that hard so far. Uh, but yeah, this is a bunch- so this is a bunch of different, like, mecha, manga, and animes mashed together. Um... Oh, she's very weak. Um, so there's like Gundam Ling, G Gundam, uh, the original Gundam. I don't know, there's a lot. I don't know them all, I've never watched any of it. Starcraft will definitely be the longest non-Japanese game. I'm pretty we're pretty certain of that, but who knows with the Japanese exclusives. I think this one will be longer than Starcraft. I'm not good, I've never played it. Yeah, I think this character is from G Gundam. Maybe it's Z Gundam? I don't know. Some sort of Gundam. Holy heck, dude. Hey, don't hit the healer, come on! die. 23% chance? Oh, we dodged it. Let's see, some of you might know, where is he? Not him. Some of you might recognize this guy and this song. Ace Attorney, yep, that's right. Why can't I heal? What the heck, man? Oh, cause I, I, that's right, I healed her with other people. I remember now. This guy's from, like, the very original Gundam. He's so overpowered that he gets two turns.
Yeah, one thing that's making this game take so long are these battle animations. You can't skip them. There's a Game Shark cheat that allows you to, but I don't want to use it. This is Celine. She's like an original character for this game. <laughs> and she's pretty strong too. This is by far the longest game. Like it's not even like kind of close. Let's shoot. Powered up! The Gundam shoes? Holy crap, dude. This is making me kind of want to watch Gundam Wing. Like, it had to be decent. It was on Toonami. I just may have killed AG. I shouldn't have done that. We'll definitely finish this in March. We've been getting going a lot quicker lately. Although this mission seems to be pretty long because there's a boss. Beep, beep, beep. Get in there, Domon. Then should they go? Oh god. Yeah, that was really cool. Big surprise, cool game for me. Yeah, you can fail missions. If you do, you just try again. Oh, yeah. Not that big of a deal. <laughs> uh, Jabawaki, thank you for the Prime Gaming sub. I appreciate it. Actually, not only that, if you fail, you keep all the XP you gained before um, losing. So, like, it actually makes it really easy. I've heard these songs a couple of times. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. Uh, there is a game called, um, there's a game called 40 Winks, which was, it was set to be released, it got to about 95% complete, and then they just stopped working on it for whatever reason. Somebody bought the code and finished the game. And so it's not an official release, but I'm playing it anyway, because apparently it's a good game. If it was garbage, I probably wouldn't.
was probably just written in C. Like, the code was probably a mess, given how old it is, but, like, um, you know. It would not be hard to find C devs. They did have the source, they purchased it. Like, I have a legal copy of that game that came with my, uh, EverDrive. If you buy your EverDrive through Stone Age Gamer, you get a copy of 40 Winks. I don't know if they did a physical release of it. I don't think they did, so it might be a ROM only. Like, it's not an official N64 game, but... I'm just playing it because apparently it's a pretty good game. So I'm like, yeah, I may as well. Uh, whatever the most modern EverDrive is, I forget. It's the one that supports Animal Crossing. Please, thank you for the Prime Gaming sub. I appreciate it. <clears throat> this is Shozama. He's from the Bison Well. An alternate dimension. I don't know if he's a Gundam character. Oh, they did release a physical version? That's cool. I have a feeling Amora is just going to annihilate this boss with the double attack and triple damage. Who needs healed? Okay, from Aura Battler Dunbine. Oh, it's because he's a main character. Yeah, that's why I'm bringing the mothership in. Nice hit, buddy. <clears throat> Ooh, 
Woohoo Loggers Gaming? What? I do mean all of them. Even this game. Almost 50 hours. I just, I didn't, I didn't use any strategy. I just ran around aimlessly. And then I eventually won. Uh, thank you for that easy win. I appreciate it. I hope nobody's getting in range of the boss. <clears throat> Glad you enjoy it. I'm very happy that people like the videos. Would I be forced to play it? No. I would only play unofficial games if they are good. You have everybody here to attack and you pick Sho, the one guy that nobody ever hits. Like the new intro? Yeah, thanks. It can grow more as, you know, as we get further in. It actually contains- I didn't notice till yesterday, it has a Pokemon Stadium 2 clip in it. Which hasn't been shown on YouTube yet, but... That's okay. Alright, only one dude left. Jesus! This game is much longer than 50 hours. Actually... Dragon Ball, as far as I know.
How much will this do? Oh my god! <laughs> Alright, I don't... <laughs> I don't think we're gonna have much trouble. What? Oh my god, dude. What? That was not supposed to happen. I don't think it matters. Even if, like, a Moro dies here, I think we're fine. <clears throat> what? You can't go for AG? Come on, man. I mean, that's actually a big mistake. I would go for a Moro. Well, your run's over. Oh, he doesn't even heal. This would have been easy. That one boss. The only reason that boss was hard is because it healed. No, it's not. They're perma dead for the mission, but you get them back for the next mission. I've won! Marg, where are you, brother? Ha 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 ha. Zool, stupid. Mars, you think you could have fought me as an equal? That was just a shadow of me. That was a waste of time. You've wasted your time. Brother! Couldn't get Marg back? All aircraft returned. What's wrong? Many mobile suit carriers approaching! Mobile suits have been launched! What the heck? Which unit? Yellow troops? Gentlemen of Marchwind, I'm Cairns of the Space Revolutionary Army White Thing. White Thing? We appreciate the power of Marchwind and request your cooperation against us, White Fang. You threaten me with a mobile suit and suddenly you do that? Is that how you ask people to do things? That's right. I refuse your offer. Currently, we, Marchwind, are acting as an independent unit, and we can't operate with White Fang. I'd like you to withdraw your troops and leave immediately. Why? Shouldn't you be in the same position as us? Don't do this with me. Then we will consider to be hostile and begin our attack. This is a little sketch. They're, they're at my crappy team. I've never had to fight yellow troops. I don't even know how this works. I think these asteroids, like, restrict your movement. I 
I guess that was just his a decoy. It wasn't really him. From what it sounds like. Dude. I'm so glad he survived that. I don't think it would have mattered, but it definitely made it less stressful. Yeah, these asteroids, man. Wow, who is that? That's Domon, heck yeah, dude. Ganondorf in the forest temple. Yeah, they're not. They're just regular soldiers. We fought these tons of these things. Oh my god, I think there's still going to be one more set of reinforcements. <laughs> oh, this mission's so long. I thought we could squeeze it in. Dude, look how bunched up they are, though. This is about to be crazy. Because Domon's right there. That is true, I ended early yesterday. That's because I thought the mission was going to be long, it ended up being really short. <laughs> Get the heck out of the way! <laughs> That's gonna save some time. Speed run strats. Yeah, that attack's actually really good. out of energy now. Yeah, Domon's in a new Gundam. I guess the God Gundam now. So, it makes sense he has a new attack. This also looks new. Dude, Domon's cracked now.
All these G Gundam people are a lot stronger than they were. set in space? I don't think so. They got stronger because they all left to pursue the Devil Gundam. Like, they've been gone for like 15 missions. Does this game ever end? You'll have to keep watching to find out. Demon's completely out of energy now. <laughs> you know what that was, don't you? An explosion. Galactic Empire troops are still coming. What a bunch of noobs. No! Captain, they're coming from the other direction! What the heck? Yes. No cutscene, just kill. What is this? Retreat! Looks like it's not the enemy. You've completed the QB Ari. Come on, Khan. Dot dot dot. The Axis battleship, Gladon, or I don't know this thing was unknown till now. Captain Bright, we're receiving a transmission from Gladon. First of all, a greeting. Okay, patch me through. It's the commander wants to come to us personally. He wants permission to land. What? That's bold! Alright, I'll see what I can do. Give him permission. Come on. It is a pleasure to meet you, gentlemen of Marchwind. I am Havan Khan, commander of the Axis forces. That's the female boss of the Axis? Isn't she a nice woman? She's like a queen. Shut up and listen. Captain Argana, this is Bright Noah. Thank you for your cooperation. What? It's nothing out of the ordinary. We have some old acquaintances here. Hey, Char Oznobel? Da da da. It's been a while. I thought you were never coming back. Is it still betrayal? In the past and now, I've never betrayed anyone. Ah, that's not what I came here for today. Gentlemen, we're prepared to fight with you against the Galactic Empire. Since we have a common enemy, it'd be nice to think we could fight together, wouldn't it? It'd be even better if we could understand the true meaning of which is to help us seek you to seek to restore Zeon. Well, well, well. It's up to you to decide what our true intentions are. But let me tell you. Don't underestimate our strength. I think it's best for both of us if I'm not your enemy. I'll consider your offer. We don't want the human race to turn on each other. Very well. I look forward to a good response. Now, if you'll excuse me... Da da da. Char, I knew it. Did Hamon and Captain Quattro know each other? It seemed like there was a lot of reason for it. No way. Lovers. Hey, I don't think that's possible. Can you believe it? I think it's not inconceivable, but it might be scary. Hey guys, sorry about that. Captain Bright, what's wrong? We just received a report. The Space Fortress Bulge has been attacked by... and destroyed. Dude, they destroyed the Bulge! The Bulge Fortress has fallen, really? 
Yes, we've just received word it's been heavily damaged by an all-out attack by the White Thing. Both Commander Jamatov and Special Colonel Basuk were killed in action. Wait a minute, did you say White Thing? Yes, sir. Oh my god, I don't care if it's the Galactic Empire. That bulge is on the White Thing. I don't believe it. I can't believe they had that kind of capability. That's impossible. Hey, guys, look at the monitor. What's going on? White Fang's making a statement, and the old man with the bad eyes is talking like he's the best. In the past, the Earth side has always used force to oppress our space colonies that wish to establish peaceful autonomy. In the past, we've used force to oppress the space colonies, whether it was during the Federation era or the Oz era when the aliens were eliminated. Now that the Earth Sphere is facing a new crisis, we can't overlook its sins. Our enemies are all beings rooted in the Earth, and we, the White Fang of the Space Revolutionary Army, have welcomed the leader to carry out our cause. Hey, that guy's... What do you mean? Zex? To correct the Earth Sphere, this is the time to take action. My name is Miliardo Peacecraft. I hereby declare the elimination of all but the colonies. That's absurd! Zex, why? Well, it was his Gundam that brought down the bulge, but why? Earth will be in trouble for this, you know? What you've done? Or is he out of his mind? Zex, you, why? Big Brother, what does that mean? Mr. Miliardo, I'm not sure what to make of it. Lady Lelina, I'll leave you to it. Dorothy, where are you going? I've decided on my next battleground. I must say goodbye, Lady Lelina. I'll miss you, but perhaps I'll see you sooner than I thought. Dorothy! Good day, Lady Lelina. Take care. Who is this guy? <laughs> Uh, this is Howard. Zex, you idiot. Oh, come on. Seriously? What was that guy thinking? Zex, from the future that Epion showed you, you chose it. And I must kill you. Zex, you were the one who announced the opening of the unit. That's why you're my friend. Mr. Trace, prepare yourself. I've already got the Foundation's top brass and the rest of Romfell's core under control. Queen Lelina, I'm going to ask you to leave the stage for now. What's about to happen is still too much for you. Your time is not yet up. Once you realize there's still a future for this planet as a hope for the people of the Earth Sphere. Mr. Trace, come on. All right, let's go, lady. The audience is waiting. Uh, where are we? You're awake, Captain Marg. I'm Rose, your second in command. Rose? Captain? What's wrong with you? I can't remember anything. The captain has erased all his memories. Why? To live in the future. In the future? I'll explain the mission this way. What is this? This is the Army of Earth. It's divided into several forces, but our advanced fleet of the Galactic Empire's forces aims to identify them regardless of their strength and to inflict as much damage as possible. Earth. And the most important mission is that His Majesty Emperor Zul has just given the captain is to eliminate the traitor Mars. Eliminate the traitor Mars? This Mars guy's infiltrated Earth, hasn't he? Yes. Traitor Mars, wait for me. I will kill you. Ugh. It was a long mission. Anybody know who Domon is? Is this him? Oh, 
like a partial any smilers. Ooh, is that him? No. I don't see Domon. This is Domon? All the attacks I can level up are bad. I guess you can't level him up well, because maybe it's a super form. That's unfortunate. Let's level up our mothership's armor. That's probably worth it. He has more attacks now. I was using them in that battle, but I think they're only available in his super form or whatever. So maybe you can't level them up? I don't know. I don't think I've ever clicked any of these. Anyway, that is the end of today's stream. Um, thank you all for watching. I really appreciate it. <laughs>